All right, today I'm going to show you how to stick some simple decals. There's two types of uh, decal preparation. This one uses a transfer tape that is uh, not as clear, but you can still see the graphic. Uh, a lot of times these things are prepared with staples in the corner. Before you start, you just want to get rid of those staples. It's not a big deal. Just get rid of those. Then you want to have your nice clean surface, whether it be a vehicle or a, you know, a toolbox or something. Position your graphic basically where you want it. The way I like to stick them is use a hinge. I usually take some, uh, some tape here. And we're going to put a hinge in the center. So let's say I measured it and I positioned it in place and it's where I want it. This is why I call it a hinge. Stick it in the middle and then when you put your graphic down, you're going to flip the side over here. Carefully peel that back. You're going to cut this paper off. I use a pair of scissors. Get rid of that. Now I got myself a squeegee. That's what I'm going to use to put the graphic down here. It's pretty simple. You just flip your image back over, slide it on. Nice firm pressure. Got the part stuck. You're going to peel your hinge off now. This is what's going to hold the rest of your graphic in place. Same thing with the other side. You're going to gently peel the back paper off, leaving the graphic exposed. If you don't have a squeegee like this, it's not a big deal. Get yourself a license, your gift card, or a credit card. You can get a paper towel, regular everyday paper towel. Just wrap that up in there like that. And there, you got instant squeegee. Hold that graphic nice and flat. Gently come along, squeeze it into place, same thing, nice firm pressure, really sticks the graphic on. A lot of these vinyls are pressure sensitive, meaning that you need to have a little bit of heat and pressure, that's what activates the glue. So now you got your graphic stuck on your surface, again it could be a vehicle, a toolbox, your friends, back, whatever. So now I'm going to gently peel the top layer off, and when I do this I like to keep the graphic uh, the, the transfer tape flat as I can because you're not pulling up, you're pulling sideways and that's going to help keep the graphic in place if there's any loose pieces. This way you'll have no bubbles, your graphic will come off nice and smooth, there's a little bubble there so I'm going to take my little squeegee and just kind of go over it afterwards, make sure there's nothing sticking up and that's as simple as it gets. The other type of uh, transfer is a clear transfer tape. It's done exactly the same way you would position your uh, graphic in place. For this I'm not going to do a hinge because it's small. So let's say I put this on the back window of my vehicle. I would put, position it, make sure my window is clean, put my tape on the top, then we can just flip it up. No need to cut, you can peel the whole tape off. I mean the whole back paper, not the tape. And then you got your graphic. Make sure it's not stuck there. Take your uh, homemade squeegee credit card, come from the top, gently slide down, squeegee again, nice firm pressure, pushing that into place, you're going to tear off your top layer here right after we peel the tape, so you got a clear layer holding it in place, it's exactly the same, it's just a little bit thinner, I like to use the clear layer so you can see exactly where you're going to position it a little bit better. Again, holding the transfer tape flat as you can, pulling it sideways rather than up, because you can see sometimes the graphic doesn't want to stick all the way. Peel that off. Again, gently go over your graphic one more time. And there you go. It's as easy as that. That's how you stick your everyday decals and graphics that you might get from uh, one of the graphic houses out there.